And I don't know if that'll have been long enough. Like, I found that two minutes wasn't long enough, so maybe four is. It is! Oh, wow! Hello! Ah, uh, so they don't pop. Diet, none. Hello! Aren't you special? Look at you, you're so shiny! Ah. Oh. Well, he's now the ambassador to the golds after the uh, the little incident uh, that happened at the headquarters, the uh, Moss Blanket Vault. I thought, you know, here, look, I know this isn't the Moss Blanket Vault, but this is, uh, you know, it's Moss Blankety, isn't it? And I'm going to be changing the trees and stuff to make it even more Moss Blankety for your liking, sir. So I hope this sort of smooths over any issue between, oh, there you guys between me and the gold community um, that you even have a, a, a slime ball hoop and what what's that oh you don't mind if I stand on top of you when I'm playing slime ball oh that's very kind of you oh that is very nice and we have the uh, the, the tabby prisoner here of course task sympathizer anyway cool on I go I think that that's a really cool addition look at the uh, look well look at this I love the way that if you have that tank highlighted, it fills up the little gauge at the bottom as you fill up the tank. That's a really nice addition. And also the colour matches the kind of plot you're putting in. Well, the, the thing, because each thing has its own colour now. It matches the colour as it fills up. Ah, oh, they're all beautiful and clean again. All your corrals are clean, apart from yours, because yours is always a mess. Clean up your room, but... Ah, oh, and he looks happy about it. Fantastic. Now that I have the ambassador here, I should uh, clean up. So this one's going to be moss blanket inspired. I can't have uh, stuff like verdant grass because that's an ancient ruins thing. What else? Let's see. So there's one patch there that looks like that could do with a tree. Uh, sunburst trees are ruins things. So another tree. Uh, fire flowers. There are. Uh, uh, volcano thing, can't have them here. Oh, two more trees, although they're both moss blanket trees, so they're fine as they are. Uh, another patch of verdant grass by the look of it, although that could just be mint grass. Minty grass, yeah, that is minty grass. Uh, but I will hold on to that for now. Uh, I'll just pick up all of these so I know what I'm working with and then I can sort of check where they are from. So, I have one, two, three, four trees to place. One, two, non trees to place. Cool. That should be fairly easy to, to work up stuff. I, I mean, they don't all have to be trees. There are some uh, mossy stumps or something, which might look nice. So I'll have a look at the options available. I think minty grass is a moss blanket thing, so that could always go back. But I'll also have a look at flower patches and stuff. So what do we have? Decorations. Can I make the butterscotch lamp? I can. Fantastic. So, mossy tree stump, glow cones, I don't particularly like the look of, wildflower, pa ooh, jumbo shroom, that might be nice. Uh, minty grass I already have, so, uh, wildflower patch, uh, let's get a mossy stump, two more trees, I've already forgotten the numbers, um, coral formations, yeah, they're an indigo quarry thing. Let's get a shroom just in case. Okay, and that should be enough. Starting with here, let's go with... Uh, is a tree in the way? Uh, sort of over... yeah, maybe not. Let's try the stump instead. Let's rotate that a bit. Uh, a little bit more. 
so it's like the, the low side over here. Nice. What else do we have? Uh, it looks like they already have pat like natural patches of this grass. Well, definitely a tree here to uh, frame the doorway. Like so. Uh, turn a little bit more. Like so. Ah, uh, yeah. Nice glow off the torch. So this one has to be something low. So shrimp. That's not a shrimp. That's the opposite of a shrimp. A shroom. But no, it, I thought it might look good, but it doesn't. So let's try minty patch. To be honest, the minty grass gets lost in all of this. Uh, wildflowers. Hmm. Not convinced by this anymore. Yeah, let's turn it away from the fire so it looks less like a fire hazard. Uh, next one. Those two are both sorted. Oh yes, another tree framing this. So, mossy tree. It doesn't really frame it. It's a bit too short, you know? But still, that's not too bad. Uh, this one's got to be... That's got to be the minty grass. Anything else would be in the way. And this leaves this as the shroom. Actually, that looks kind of nice there, because it looks like a baby version of that tree with the uh, sort of the flat leaves. Okay. Climb up here. So, what do you think of the uh, the new diplomatic studio? Would you like to uh, just take, uh, take a spin to have a look? Oh, he likes it. He looks really happy about it. Well, fantastic. Uh, I do want to put the butternut squash guy down so I'll put that here oh that's a quantum one that's obviously a quantum one I was, for some reason I was convinced that was going to be a gold but anyway that's fine he looks okay there so there we go that's all decorated now I think it looks really lively here and oh, oh the yeah this definitely fits the moss blanket. I mean, I know it is the moss blanket area anyway, but I think it fits it rather than sort of going against the theme that was already here. So for the others, I'm thinking uh, ancient ruins as the main ranch area because of all the open area for the sunburst trees, which are still my favourite decoration in this game. Uh, what else? There's the docks. I'm thinking the docks is going to be just the dry reef. And the uh, grottos, the, the volcano, it's not really a, mo a uh, indigo quarry, it's, it's more specifically the volcano because of all the uh, crystals on the ceiling and stuff already. And that leaves only um, the lab as the glass desert with the crystal sculptures and stuff like that, the glass sculptures and stuff like that. So I think that'll look really nice. So I shall go do that as soon as I have finished collecting and distributing this food. You'll also be pleased to know that that is still going up. So I imagine it'll hit 400 tomorrow and then uh, it'll still be a few days before gold is, uh, is sellable. So maybe I won't be able to sell that before I clock off for the update. But instead of doing here, I'll go and do the docks. I don't actually have that much to work with down here. I've got everything as utility ones. That's a shame. Um, I have one spot there. Because all of the... The, the majority of them are these uh, dockside, uh, seaside ones, which are all, of course... My Gordo collection. Um, what's that over there? What is that? Oh, those are the floating islands that teleport to the ring island. So there's a teleporter on one of them. Anyway, um, yeah, so the, there is no space here apart from one, one thing I can place. That is a real shame, but I need that there for the pogos. I need that there for the plots, need that there for the refining, that's the teleporter, and that's it. So, one flower patch from the reef 
is all I can fit. It's got to be the coral grass patch because that's all I really have that's sort of low and from there because there's like the shrub I guess but I think that would be too in the way. It needs to be something low to not get in the way really. And that goes right there. That's nice, you know. Alright, it's not amazing admittedly, but still, it'll do. I almost forgot that I haven't decorated this area, and while I was saving a load of these place spaces for extractors, there are other places I could put extractors. So we have one... Well, that... Uh, one tall. One, two, three... Two tall... Any back here? No. Uh... Uh, three tall. Okay, space for three tall things. Luckily, as it's right here, I can just do them as and when. I don't really want the, the desert columns because I sort of already have them. So, I already have one of them. Uh, let's get one of them. And I have a fiery as well. I have a crystal sconce. And a uh, palm tree? Oh, I don't have enough silky sand to make a palm tree. But I should... No, I don't quite... It's not quite ready. How long does that have left? Ah, yeah, it'll be ready soon. Okay. So for now, let's put... Uh, I set a tall one over by the front gate. So... That one? Oh, bloody hell. Okay. Is it just me, or are they just underwhelming? It's too spindly. Uh, Alright, let's try instead the towering one. That's a bit more impressive, but yes, yeah, you just won't notice it when you're running the gate. So that's going to have to be the palm tree. Instead, that can go over here, the towering. Nice. Uh, over here... No, there's got to be a low. That one's got to be a... No, that, that one could be. If it's, you know, it's a bit underwhelming. I can sort of go there on the side. Like so. Yeah. Not amazing. I don't like that it's sort of in a big bit of rock like that. So these are dancing now, so I'll be able to go get some more silky sand to make the palm tree. Let's try this again. Palm tree all the way at the bottom. Boom. I wonder how big this one's going to be, because they've, they're all a bit smaller when you get them in this form. Apart from the sunburst tree. Maybe that's why I like the sunburst tree. Oh, that is nice and tall. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, that's that's got the feel of it. Let's see, any more tall? These, these ones I don't really want to be tall, because then they'll feel enclosing, more enclosing than the cliffs already are. Uh, one more tall back there, maybe another tree. Um, actually, no, if I move this one, I can make another tree and put it there. And that way, I don't have all the glass sculptures together. So, another palm tree, I'm still out of silky sand. Damn it. Alright, uh, leave that one blank for now then. I might need more silky sand. I don't know how many of these I'm going to be able to make. Right. Put that there, like so. Nope, let's spin it round so it's got the... There. As imposing as possible. Yeah, it's sort of out the way, but maybe distance will make you think that it's like, it's just that it's far away that it's so small. Not because it is puny and disappointing. So now I need three small ones for the desert. So there's coil grass. I don't have any pepper jam. Blocks, I don't have any pepper jam. Sorry, there was just an explosion outside. I think that was a firework. Uh, sprout, I don't have any... Yeah, I've run out of everything. Okay, whoops. Uh, let's get another couple of extractors then. So I need another apiary, but I don't have any pinks. God. At least with this many, I should be able to make two extractors.
That's interesting. The uh, pink plot usage is capped out at 25, because look, the, uh, the Master Drill uses 25, and the Titan Drill uses 25. Actually, the Titan Drill is barely more expensive, that's amazing. Anyway, uh, one of them, and I also want... <sighs> to be honest, I don't really need another one of them, I'll save my pinks. So I need to go drop this off in the desert. The real desert, that is, not this, uh, not not my, you know, my own personal lab desert. Desert lab. Area 51. That's what I'm calling it now. And this way. I wonder if I could find another, another guild of ginger, because I didn't get chance to try it. When I say I didn't get chance to try it, I completely forgot to try putting it in a garden. I'm 99% sure it won't work because it's said in the changelog that it doesn't work, but I kind of want to try it anyway, you know? Oh, I really can't be bothered to go looking. It's going to take me ages to search for it. I'd rather go back and work on uh, work on the main area of the ranch. This area. So, what do we have here? We have a fire flower patch. Can't be having that. Sunburst tree, I'll pick I'll pick them all up for now and then I'll replace them as needed. So we've got a small one there. Uh the teleporters gonna need to stay there. Got another small one there. Uh maybe a big one, depends what kind of big one. That's gotta be a small one, those have gotta be small ones. That's obs that's you know, taken already. Uh those I'm just gonna leave because they are beautiful back there. And those need to be small ones as well. So, uh, where did I pick up the sunburst tree from here, I think? Oh, I have five of them. Wow. Like so. Is it? It's not just me. They are so beautiful with those yellow leaves. I mean, the trunks are a bit bit ugly with the, with the circles on them. But apart from that, they are so pretty. Hmm. Maybe that one can be a tall one. Anything to put more sunburst trees down, you know? Nah, that's good, that's good, because he's still got plenty of uh, path space. That one has to be a small one. Do I have... Oh! Starflower patch. So overall, it's quite clear that my favourite design of area is the... Uh, the what's it, Majig? Um, Ancient Ruins. It's got the best colours with the yellow and the green. It's got the best everything, really. I really like the uh, aesthetics of the ancient ruins. What else, then? Uh, glow sticks. Yeah, I take them and leave them. Crystal sconce. I sh yeah, it's a good thing I didn't put that in the um, in the, the underground. Then again, I do have the uh, desert, pill desert column in the underground, but that's more because it's the column rather than the desert. Apologies if you can hear the fireworks going on in the background. Right, uh, let's get another... Oh, I've run out of pinks. And anything else? I have one of them. I probably won't be able to put it down anywhere. So I need more pinks. Uh, very glad I didn't make that second extractor now, because I definitely wouldn't be able to afford anything. Can I make a second one? I can. Beautiful. Just. 20 out of 20. So now I shall go and put that somewhere nice and pretty. And I reckon I will have alternating. So like flower grass flower down here. There are only two. Never mind. Alright, well flower. And then... Uh, grass, flower, like so. Thing is, they just look a bit weird. Just a patch of beautiful grass and then dirt. Hmm. Anyway, uh, over here, I'm going to need our oh, two more low things. So that's another grass patch. Let's just rotate it so that the rock isn't in the way. Mm. I need two more flower patches, really. Right, if I pick that one up, 
and put that one here instead. Rotate it to the rocks over there. So I need a flower patch there and a flower patch there, and I can't get either without pinks, so I need a total of 40 pinks for them. And then that's that's the lot. I think. Yeah, it is. This place is really pretty, isn't it? Ah, oh, look at all those sunburst trees. Oh, I could potentially put a sunburst tree here. No, I can't. I might be able to put one here, though. Pick that up, and sunburst tree, sunburst tree. Boom. Yeah, yeah, that can go there easily. I don't want them here because I sort of climb over the fence too much. Uh, nowhere else I can put one. I'm just wondering if I can... Can I pick up the, the refinery? I can. Because I want to put a sunburst tree here. Like so. And I can put the refinery... Here. Like so. Because I, if I, you know, always having to jump that, it was, I put it up there back when there was a hole in the fence so I didn't have to jump it, but now it just feels weird. So that's freed up a flower patch, which I can put, no, I'll leave that one because that'll be easier to remember about, there. Yeah. Oh, this place is so pretty now with these sunburst trees everywhere. And it matches the, the gold, the gold on there. Lovely. So I still need some pinks so that I can get one more flower patch to go over there. And actually, wondering if I actually... Maybe I can swap this. And instead put a crystal sconce here. Like so, and the flower patch up here, we'll see how that looks. So flower patch there, that works. Dooby doo. Go around here. Crystal sconce, that's not really in the way. Plenty of space around it, yeah. It's a bit weird, but I kind of like it. So what do you think of my decorations? With my um, volcano grotto, with my moss, uh, overgrown moss blanket, my uh, barely dry docks. The dry docks! Ah! Oh. Yeah, there's really not much decoration here. It's just a single patch of grass. But anyway. And uh and my my ancient ranch. It's beautiful. This is a really good game. So that's, that's still going up. I pretty much run out of things to do now. I just need my extractors to 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 finish their cycles so that I can get some more pepper jam to make the last thing I need, but that's going to be a while. So I think what I will do is uh, do the rounds again, see how much more money I can scrounge up. And then this will probably be the last session until uh, the next patch. I did want to get the 7Z, but again, that's just something I need to... Um, uh, yeah, I'll be able to get that when I get the golds, and the golds is just a matter of time. I now have enough to put down another couple of decorations. So a palm tree here like so, and a coil grass, let's see, there are three spots here for it, let's just try it on the first one, mm, coil grass, Ooh. right, actually, how about I call it that, so, I leave, uh, no, yeah, yeah, alright, I'll leave it there for now, and I'll, I'll save these three for extractors, I'll put the coil grass there, and uh, then sort of we're golden. Then that's this this area done completely. And I still need another 20 pinks. Or did I? No, I moved it round, so never mind. I don't need more 20, 20 more pinks. So yeah, now I'm, I'm done. I'm done with the decorations. My ranch is complete. This is a really tough one for me. I, part of me really wants to play another day just to get the gold price up, but I know it's not going to go up high enough in one more day. I reckon one more day and it'll get up to 400, but that's not high enough to sell them, so 
I, I either play another like four days or I call it here and then come back on the next patch. So I'll be back with the next patch. Um, unless I feel a burning urge to play Slime Rancher. And now that I've got the Gold Gordo, that's sort of gone away for a bit. So thank you very much for watching. I'll be back with more soon. Let me know what you think of the decorations and I will catch you later.